Hey everyone, welcome back to ECA Tech. Today we're talking about troubleshooting in the workplace. We've all been there. Something isn't working, systems are down, or maybe a project's off track, whatever the issue. Troubleshooting is a critical skill for keeping things running smoothly. So let's talk about three key troubleshooting tips for companies that can save you time, money and stress. All right, first up, figure out what's really causing the problem. It's tempting to jump to solutions right away, especially when there's pressure to fix things quickly. But if you don't dig into the root cause, you might just be addressing the symptoms, not the actual issue. For example, if your company's website is slow, it's easy to assume the server is the issue. But is that really it? Maybe it's a bandwidth problem, outdated code, or even a security threat. Taking the time to investigate properly will prevent you from wasting resources on the wrong fix. A great approach is the five whys method. Ask why, repeatedly to peel back the layers of a problem until you uncover the real cause. Once you understand the root, then you can start working on the right solution. Tip number two is all about collaboration. Remember, you don't have to troubleshoot in isolation. In fact, getting input from different team members can be a game changer when you're trying to solve complex issues, whether it's the IT team, customer support, or the sales department. Each area of your company has unique insights that can help troubleshoot more effectively. Let's say you're dealing with customer complaints about your software being difficult to use. You might want to gather your developers, designers, and customer service team together. The developers might pinpoint technical bugs, the designers could flag user experience issues, and the customer support reps can highlight recurring complaints. This cross-team collaboration helps you see the full picture and find solutions faster. Plus, it creates a culture where employees feel empowered to share their ideas and knowledge. The third tip is documenting the troubleshooting process and learning from it. This step often gets overlooked, but it's a crucial part of long-term success. After you've solved the issue, document everything. What went wrong? How you identified the problem? What steps were taken to fix it? And any lessons learned? Why? Because next time a similar issue arises, you'll have a blueprint for solving it quickly. Documenting solutions also helps with onboarding new employees, improving systems, and even spotting patterns you might not have noticed before. You might find that a recurring issue keeps popping up. And that's when you know it's time for a more permanent fix. Also, think about sharing this documentation across teams. A centralized knowledge base of troubleshooting experiences can help everyone in your company become more efficient when problems arise. So there you have it. Three essential troubleshooting tips for companies. First, make sure to identify the root cause of the problem before jumping to solutions. Second, leverage your team's knowledge by collaborating across departments. And third, document everything and use it as a learning tool to prevent future problems. Troubleshooting doesn't have to be overwhelming. With the right approach, you can turn problems into opportunities for growth and improvement.